hello guys today in this video we will learn how to install the dotnet sdk or the runtime on ubuntu so to do that we are following going to follow the microsoft document so you can see here the are the versions of ubuntu operating system which are which is supporting the dotnet 6 so we will install it the dotnet 6 so you can see it is installing the ubuntu version 21.10, 21.04 and 20.04 it is the LTS version so I have installed the Ubuntu here the, this is the Ubuntu terminal and it is running right now inside the Windows WSL 2 program so you can see I have logged in here and this is the Ubuntu terminal and here my version of this Ubuntu is 20.04 that means this is the LTS version of the Ubuntu okay and in this version we can install dotnet 3.1 dotnet core 5.0 and dotnet 6.0 okay so we are going to install the latest one okay to do that what i will do i will just click here and it will navigate to the bottom of the page where all the things are mentioned to install the dotnet core or dotnet 6 inside ubuntu 20.04 version so here you can see it is saying to install this we need to run first the below command in the terminal so i will copy this and i will go ahead in the terminal and here i will paste it okay and you can see it is asking for my password so i will put here my password okay and now it is going to do these things okay now the first command is run so now I will install the SDK using this command so I will just click here on the copy and then I will go to terminal and here I either I can do control V or right click to paste it so it is asking me to paste so just click on paste anyway and then need to hit enter and you can see now it is installing the dotnet 6.0 okay the sdk of dotnet 6.0 okay and once after installing the sdk of dotnet uh, 6.0 i am going to install the runtime of the dotnet okay so this is the runtime command and you here you can see first uh, why we need to need the runtime so we need runtime when we are trying to host the dotnet application on the ubuntu server so for the development purpose we need not we do not need any runtime but for the hosting purpose we must need to have the runtime installed on our server either it is windows server or ubuntu server or any other server okay so it is very very mandatory to be to install the dotnet runtime so once let it finish then i will install the dotnet runtime as well but yeah right now it is not uh, it is not required for now for the development but yes i am going to do that and again i will right click to paste it and here i am going to hit enter so now it is installing the runtime okay you can see here in the command it is written here the runtime okay So this is also okay it is still doing the things here okay so now it is also installed so you can see here ASP.NET runtime 6.0 set to manually installed okay and already the newest version that means I have already installed it but if it was not there then it it will install so uh, either you can also run the upgrade of Ubuntu then again it will install these things automatically so yes it's already installed so therefore it has not installed it just skipped okay but when you will install it for the first time then definitely it is going to complete the whole process okay so in this video that's all guys so thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you